Hello! This computer movie will explain how to go to space using only the 10 hundred words in our language that people use the most. Going to space is hard. First, because the Earth pulls things toward it. So not only do you have to fight the Earth's pull to get to space, you also have to go really fast to the side so that when you fall back toward Earth, you miss and go around instead. That's how you stay in space. The best way we know of to get to space and stay there is an upgoer that burns fire water, usually made from old dead animals or the kind of air that once burned a big sky bag and people died. The burning fire water hits the inside of the upgoer so hard that it pushes the upgoer up. Actually, it pushes the upgoer away from where the fire comes out. If the fire end points towards space, you are having a bad problem and will not go to space today. There are often several fire water burning parts to an upgoer so that after you use up the fire water in one part, you can drop it and don't have to lift it all the way to space, too. Space is cold and has no air, so if you want to go to space and live, you need to be on an upgoer that has a room for people in it, usually on top. This room has heaters and air and no holes so that you can stay alive, and a window so that you can enjoy looking at Earth from space. It also has a thick side so that if you want to come back from space, you won't burn up from all the air you hit on the way down. Hitting air helps slow you down a lot, but to help slow down even more, there are big sheets to catch air too, so you don't hit the ground too hard. We humans pretty much always have several upgoers almost ready to go to space, but if you tried to get in one of them, a lot of people would get really mad at you and you'd get in trouble and probably go into a locked room behind bars. If you want to use an upgoer to go to space instead of into that room, you have to have many important people say okay. Before they say okay, you have to prepare to go to space for many years. If you want to be like many people who went to space in the past, you should go to school to learn to fly skyboats and be really good at it. You also need to be able to see and hear very well and not get a sick body or head. There are many other things you need to be good at too, and you need to be lucky. But if you're good and lucky and all the important people say okay, then maybe you can go to space someday. Thanks for watching. If you like confusing stuff explained in simple words, you'll probably like the book Thing Explainer by the man who wrote the picture story XKCD, and the book called What If. You can find Thing Explainer at bookstores, or by using your computer to search the place where many computers think together, or by looking in the words below this computer movie. I also want to add that I am a huge fan of XKCD and I'm just super excited to be able to make this video. You should definitely check out Thing Explainer if you're into XKCD. It's a great book, it's really fun. The drawings are really fun to pour through and Randall's done a great job with it. Uh, it's beautiful. And if you like this video, this style of video, please let me know, share it. I'm excited to see what you think. Thanks for watching.